Hi and welcome to the video. In this video I'm just going to show you how to change the shipping options for an individual product. So you might want to do this if you've got a large bulky item for example and you don't actually want to ship it and you want to offer in-store pickup only for example and there's loads of other reasons you might want to do it but I'm going to show you how. So to start with you need to log into the store section of your Fastace e-commerce package and then we're going to go to the product you want to change the shipping options for. So go to products under catalog and let's just change it here for apples. So if we go to tax and shipping here, we've got by default shipping rates is going to say use your store shipping method. So that's all the shipping options you've set in your uh, in your shipping section here. So anything that's in there will be available for this item. However, if you want to specify this different shipping method, you can click on that. And you've got two options here. You can enable specific methods. So if we use that one, and use the drop down it's going to show us all the shipping methods for our store so we could just enable raw mail economy for this one if we wanted to and that's going to disable all the rest of it or alternatively if we just go ahead and delete that and that's going to be empty if we want to disable specific methods that's just the opposite way around you can just leave everything enabled except the specific ones so if you've got tons of shipping options uh, it's going to depend on which one of those you use so next up, we've got fixed rate per item. Um, we can set a fixed rate for this item. Um, that's just going to do that. Pretty self-explanatory. And also we've got free shopping, uh, free shipping here. Sorry, not free shopping. Uh, free shipping, so you can just offer free shipping for this particular item. One thing worth noting as well, if you want to add additional fees for an item, uh, or, but you want to keep all the shipping options. So for example, it's something that needs a lot of packaging and you just want to add an extra 50p or a pound to the packaging to cover that. Under the using your sure store shipping methods, you can click this add fixed fee per item here and you can add an extra additional fee to cover that. So if, you, if I added a pound there and their shipping was going to be three pound from the shipping method they chose, it would be four pound altogether. So that's all there really is to it. Let's just go ahead and delete that. So one thing as well worth noting um, with this specify the shipping methods. If you create conflicts, i.e., for example, if I enabled Royal Mail uh, economy for this one, so everything else was disabled. Uh, check that. So if I, for this one, Royal Mail economy is enabled, but if, they, if then I added another product into my basket that had that particular mail, that particular one disabled, your customer is not going to be able to check out with both items in their in their cart. They'll get a warning, but they'll have to do two separate orders. So it's worth noting um, that if you do create conflicts, that's just going to mean your customers have to do more orders. But that's the end of the video. I don't think there's anything else really to it than that. So thanks very much for watching. Goodbye for now.